what's up guys welcome back to my channel or if it's your first time welcome in general my name is Reese and before we get started if you have not yet make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and also turn on your post notifications so that you're notified when I upload a video and also do your girl a favor and follow me on Instagram I'm trying to get to 10k period <laughs> I'm trying to get the 10k so that I can have the swipe up feature on Instagram so that I can link my videos directly from my story so definitely if you are not following me on Instagram make sure you do that help me out you know I'm kind of far away I'm only at 2k but you know with y'all I have hope that I can get to 10k super quick so do me a favor and follow me on Instagram. I'll have it linked down below. So as you guys can tell by the title, today I'm gonna to be reviewing this unit. And then I'm also gonna show you like a few ways that you can style it if you don't wanna just go for the basic wearing it down look. So yeah, if you guys wanna see how I style this unit and get more details on it, then just keep on watching. Guys, so this is the unit that I'm going to be trying on and reviewing today. And this is Part of the Big Beautiful Hairline by Outre, and it's a half wig, and this one I got in um, the style 3A Passion Curl in the color DR425. So this is what the packaging looks like. You can see the model there, and the style and color, and then this is all the other colors that they offer. So this is the color. That's so red. <laughs> Oh my gosh this is what the curls are looking like look how red that is whoa I wasn't expecting that much red but it's cute right and then it has the black roots so these are the curls super pretty this is straight out of the pack I'm definitely probably gonna fluff them a little bit but this is how it looks and then as far as the construction of the cap you're gonna get two combs right at the front and then you also will get one long comb in the back and then of course you will also get your adjustable straps so this is the new construction you can see it's much thinner at the top and they say that the fact that it's thinner will make it easier to blend and more comfortable to wear and also you don't need as much leave out. You know I love a deep part. Period. These curls are super cute and it's nice and light and fluffy. Soft. Oh yeah, this is cute. Hey sis. Alright, so I'm gonna go like figure out my leave out and how I am gonna wear it. You could wear it like this. Boom. Oh B. That's easy. I wear it like this. Hey y'all. You can wear it with a bang in the front and you don't even have to cut it. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, I like this. I can't see the top, but I'll let y'all see the top. I'm sure you can't see any tracks. This is so cute, y'all. Okay, so I went ahead and pulled out some leave out. <laughs> Look how dark it is. Woo! Anyway, so I put out some leave out, but I'm just gonna show you like a couple different ways, a few different ways you can wear this unit. And so, like I already showed you guys, if you're feeling like a no leave out kind of day, girl, just push these curls to the front and you're good to go. Don't have to worry about any leave out.
And if you wanna pull the edges down, sis, do that. It's up to you. I don't know where my edge brush is, so I'm just gonna use this big old brush. Now you have cute half up, half down with some swooped edges. This hair is cute. Alright y'all, so that's style number two. And I'm gonna show you guys one more style. Honestly, I'm kind of thinking of these as I go. But you know, we just gonna go with the flow. So you can obviously just wear it down, not only to the front, but to the side. Okay, this looks crazy because it's pulled up. Pull this down. Tuck this back. So you can wear it down to the side too. Like a deep. Oh yeah, this is cute. This is cute too. This is another way you guys could wear it. It's just down to the side. This is probably how I'm going to wear it today. That's cute. And I literally didn't do anything to my leave out. Like, and it does not blend. It just doesn't. Let's be honest. My leave out does not blend. But it don't matter because this hair is just so big and curly. Like, you don't even have to do that much work. But I will say, if you do want this hair to blend with your hair, um, all you have to do is take some flexi rods or some perm rods and perm rod the front of your hair, let it dry, take it out, and blend it in. Like, it'll blend so well. This curl pattern is like just like a flexi rod or a perm rod. So, if you're looking for a way to blend your hair with this, definitely do some rods. But you know, I'm okay with it just like this. So this is another way you could wear. I guess that's kind of three ways. So we did the bang in the front. We did the half up, half down. We did this deep side part. And I'm going to do one more style that I have in my head. Hopefully it comes out right. So I'm just going to take a scrunchie and put it in like a pineapple on top of my head. So let me do that. Yeah, I wasn't even planning on doing a bun, but this is cute. But let me unravel it and see how it look with just a puff. So yeah, you could do a bun or just a puff. Period. Alright you guys, so those are the looks. So I really just gave y'all like four looks, five looks, I don't know. But comment down below which one you like the best. Do you like the bang in the face? Do you like a deep part on the side? Do you like the half up, half down? Do you like the bun? Or do you like the poof? That was five. Five ways that you can style your half wig. And girl, it's like it takes no work at all. So, all right, you guys. So that is going to conclude this video. I hope that you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below. Also, click that bell notification symbol so that you're notified when I upload because you need to see the tea first, period. <laughs> Thank you so much to Outre for sending me this unit to review. I will have all the information on this unit and how you can get your hands on this unit down below. So be sure to check the description box. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I love you and I'll see you in the next one.